The Terminal List was released on Amazon Prime Video in July of 2022, and fans want to know about the next season. The main question they're asking is whether there'll be a second season or not of the Chris Pratt series. We've also seen some people asking whether the show's cast will be returning for a second season and wondering what might happen in it. These are all questions we're going to try and answer for you in this video. So, the show's first season followed Lieutenant Commander James Reese, played by Chris Pratt. He's the only survivor of an ambush that killed his entire team of Navy SEALs. The Terminal List also features a pretty interesting hook where Reese is diagnosed with a fatal brain tumor. However, that's not all he has to go through. He also discovers a massive cover-up involving everyone from his chain of command to politicians. This is a conspiracy. This is when Reese decides to seek vengeance and goes on a killing spree to kill all those who wronged him and his team. The series also has a stellar cast with the likes of Constance Wu, Taylor Kitsch, Jan Triplehorn, and Jai Courtney, who all gave top-notch performances. When the show was first released, it didn't get a very good reaction from certain critics for its espoused political views. Well, that aside, the show has a lot of fans and was executed to perfection, and it performed really well on Amazon Prime Video. The Terminal List ended up being watched for a whopping 1.4 billion minutes in the second week of streaming. This meant that it came in second only to Stranger Things. Could the critics be wrong? No. It's the children who are wrong. One of the main reasons why people aren't so sure that the Terminal List Season 2 will happen is because the first season's finale was so well wrapped up. What does this mean? The finale saw James Reese finally managing to cross all the names off his list, leaving a wreckage of explosions, bodies, and blood in his wake. We last saw Reese sailing away looking rather peaceful after disposing of all the people responsible for the death of his family and his troops. So, he got his revenge. But he still has to deal with that fatal brain tumor which was the catalyst for everything that took place in the first season. This might make you think that we won't get to see any more seasons of The Terminal List. But you'd be wrong. You're wrong. During an interview with Digital Spy, when Pratt was asked about the potential second season, he gave a rather cryptic answer saying, Well, Jack Carr has written five extraordinary books. Chris Pratt also spoke with the author of the books, Jack Carr, for his podcast, Danger Close, to discuss the series. When Carr asked the actor if there would be more of the show, Pratt spoke about the rabid fans and then said that those fans have absolutely nothing to worry about, and that they love all the passion and support. Pratt added that they are working towards keeping the fans of the show happy. We're thinking that means that there's another season of the show in the works. Jack Carr Cinevision Universe. In an interview with comicbook.com, showrunner David DiGilio hinted that the terminal list would follow Jack Carr's chronology, saying, I'd encourage anyone who loves season one to go and check out True Believer. It's an incredible read and it's the great blueprint for season two. By the end of the terminal list season one, not many characters are left. The only real guarantee would be Chris Pratt as James Reese. And since True Believer takes place on foreign soil and deals with foreign terrorists, one could expect a brand new cast of characters. It's going to be really, really hard for Amazon to ignore the show moving forward. However, we still don't have an official renewal announcement from Amazon. Jack Carr has written five more books involving Jack Reese, so they have a lot of source material to draw from should they go ahead and make more seasons of the show. Eyes on the horizon, boys. Thanks for watching and see you next time.